couple of days back the new Jira 7.10 version was released and I was interested in understanding how this new version will look like because in Jira 7.10 the new UI is supposed to be released and people were wondering whether this new UI will look like the cloud version of Jira or whether it will be something different. So I upgraded one of my instance of Jira and I decided to try it out. And before I show you the new Jira interface, I just want to read the release notes. So as per the Jira software 7.10 release notes, you can see here that uh, it says that the new fresh look will be there. It has a new UI and as per the release notes, they have written very clearly that there is no change in the navigation. So this is quite good because uh, there were some not very good feedback about the cloud navigation because they have changed it completely. The navigation is actually on the left hand side and the way you interact with your Jira features, the way you do your customizations is slightly complicated in the new Jira cloud interface. However, in Jira 7.10 for the server, the interface is quite similar to the old one and I'll show you in a moment. So moving on to the next feature in the Jira 7.10 is the archiving of projects and that is really good because uh, right now there is no such feature in Jira to archive your project. You need to do it manually or you need to make it read only and people usually delete their projects and keep it on a separate server using a backup. But in the new version for data center only, you can now archive the projects. And I believe this is a very good feature because uh, you can now expect some performance improvement. Apart from this, the rest of the features and the release note says few other improvements about a refreshed list of project. So it means that if you go to the administration and then if you go to the project section, they have uh, written something about some improvement in the list of projects, the way it appears on the admin section. And uh, they're also talking about uh, some better integration with uh, Stride. So let us now take a look at the new interface itself. So the first thing that you will notice is the login screen and definitely the colors are different. You can see the new font because uh, people who are familiar with Jira and if they have been working on Jira for a long time, they will definitely feel something different and especially the colors and the font are now definitely different. It looks good. It looks more sleek and you can also notice the new Jira logo. So let us now log in and let us now take a look at how Jira dashboard looks like. So the moment you log in, you will be presented with your dashboard and I'm very happy because it looks exactly like the old interface, especially the navigation. So the way you interact with Jira, the way you work on your projects. And if you are Jira administrator, I'm sure you can go to the Jira admin section and you will find the same old navigation. So that is a good thing. However, the interface definitely looks different especially in terms of color and the font. Let us now create a new issue because I just want to understand if there is any difference in terms of uh, how the issue creation works. So the create issue screen looks uh, similar. I don't see any difference. On cloud, the create issue screen is slightly different and uh, it also looks slightly different, but mostly in terms of again font and the color you can see a different color for the create button so let us let us quickly create a new task or a new issue and i can see some difference in the way they display the description visual and text mode and i believe it is mostly the ui based changes so i, I don't really think they have changed anything in terms of the feature so let us now quickly create a new issue and let us take a look at the issue view screen. So we have a new issue 
if I go to the issue by going to the issues option on top. So this is the issue that I created. It looks uh, similar to the old Jira version. So this is your uh, Jira issue view screen. The first immediate thing that I noticed is the sidebar on the left hand side. This is definitely similar to the old Jira interface. However, the icons are different and they look slightly better in my opinion. So I'm personally happy with this. And if I take a look at the issue itself, it is again similar. There are some clear indication of new UI in the button itself. The buttons are more sleek. The font on top of the buttons, the label of the buttons, they are also different. And if I take a look at the issue itself, it is more or less similar to the old one. However, as I mentioned earlier, most of the changes are with the font and the color. So not major difference here. If I click on the view workflow link, let me take a look at how the workflow is displayed for the issue. So this is again similar to the old Jira interface. Let me now try to search for the issue in my Jira instance. So if I go to the search bar on top and the moment I place my cursor on the search bar, I can immediately see the list of recent issues. And this is definitely improved way to search because in the previous version of Jira, there was not easy way to search or perform the instant search in Jira. So if I try to search for something like sample, it will probably give me the list of all the issues. And before I actually click on the issue, I can view a small snippet or a summary of the issue on the left hand side. So this is definitely an improvement over the previous versions of Jira. And if I quickly take a look at the admin section to understand if there is any major improvement so this is the Jira administration section and uh, it is similar to the old version. There are not many differences that I can notice apart from the color and the font. We have the same applications tab. We have the same projects tab. Let me take a look at the projects tab to understand if there is any major difference. It looks similar so far. So yes, this is uh, not very different from the old version. If I go to the issues section, so you spend a lot of your time as a Jira administrator on the third tab, that is the issues tab. So this is again similar to the old Jira version. So overall, I think the interface is certainly better and uh, what Atlassian is trying to do, they are trying to have this common UI for all the Atlassian applications, especially on the cloud version where you have a similar UI and the similar navigation for Jira and for cloud and also for Bitbucket. But on the Jira server version or maybe on the or on the server version of Confluence, the interface is different, but the navigation is similar to the old version of uh, Jira application. I hope this video was useful. Thank you very much.